Greetings everyone. I am Dr. S.P. Manik Prabhu, Senior Consultant Neurosurgeon and Neurointerventionist from Care Hospital, Banjara Hills, Hyderabad. Today I am going to talk about winter and brain stroke. Uh, as the winter increases the brain stroke risk uh, through cold mediated uh, hypertension, the winter increases the risk of uh, uh, stroke, brain stroke uh, through various different mechanisms. The first one is the cold mediated increase in the blood pressure because the cold causes the increase in the sympathetic uh, overactivity from the brain system leading to increase in the blood pressure which can cause rupture of the blood vessels inside the brain leading to hemorrhagic stroke or a brain bleeds. The second mechanism which causes is the increase in the thickness of the blood or the viscosity because people tend to uh, take uh, less water during winter and there is no not much of a physical activity which can also decrease the water intake leading to clotting inside the blood vessel causing ischemic stroke. And also the uh, respiratory infections increases during the winter leading to the systemic inflammation which in turn causes the breakage of the blood vessel plaques leading to embolic or the ischemic stroke. And in, in winter, there is a decrease in the vitamin D levels also, which can indirectly contribute to the physical fatigability leading to uh, decreased activity and also the stroke. How to prevent the stroke in the winter? So first is like uh, keeping yourself well hydrated and taking adequate fluids, even though in winter it is there and uh, keeping yourself warm and exercising indoors and doing ex yoga or stretching exercise to increase the blood flow blood flow to the limbs as well as the brain and adjusting the blood uh, blood pressure medication as the during winter the blood pressure medication requirement may, may go up which should be done with consultation of the, with the doctor and also taking the vaccination for the respiratory illnesses like influenza uh, which uh, decreases the incidence of the respiratory diseases and the stroke risk and also vitamin D supplement and the healthy diet which will uh, safeguard you against the winter ailments and most important thing is uh, recognizing the stroke that is uh, learning how to recognize a stroke which can save the time and reaching the hospital like one is the asymmetry of the face or uh, somebody's face is like one side is drooping and there is a arm weakness or the limb weakness and the loss of speech or the stuttering which all this will say that like the patient is somebody is experiencing a stroke and he can be he should be rushed to the hospital where the stroke team a team or the CT scan and the other things are available which can be treated effectively and the patient can be saved from the lifelong morbidity and mortality risk.